welcome to my channel and day 20 of Wren's Advent Wardrobe Challenge. It's a bit later in the afternoon today because it was such a beautiful morning we decided to go out and make the most of it. In fact it was so warm out I was in a t-shirt unbelievably so I'm down at the little cafe where we like to go. It was absolutely stunning. Anyway we will see what's inside Wren's Advent Wardrobe today and it's day 20 so we've got four days left after today. And what have we got? Oh, we've got two items today. We've got a little jumper and a skirt. So we're going to put them on Wren. And uh, yeah, it's getting so close to Christmas. It seems hardly, it just seems incredible. So I think I might take her leggings off now. I hope everyone's getting ready for Christmas. We got our, our Christmas shop arrived today, so that's good. That just actually arrived a few minutes ago. And uh, there's just a few little things I need to get. Um, some cream for the pavlova. Um, and I think that's about it, really. Oh, sorry about that. So, uh, yeah, we're all set. Uh, just got to get the house tidy. The dining room, which currently is still full of stuff. And obviously I need to get that free because we're going to have family here. My son and daughter-in-law and my little baby granddaughter. Our other son's gone to spend Christmas with his girlfriend on the mainland. So my husband took him up on Sunday morning and he arrived back last night. Which is why we made the, took the advantage of going out somewhere today as the weather was so good. Because the previous couple of days have been just horrible. So... You may notice that her little top is made from the sock wool of the socks I finished the other day. So uh, I thought I'd get that knitted. And this, this skirt actually has pockets, working pockets. If I can get them around the right way, let's pop Ren's hand in them. Yep, as you can see, she can put her hand in the pockets. She's actually got two, one on each side. Put her little, little shoes on. So yeah, there she is with her new newest outfit, Christmas skirt, little sl sleeve, uh, short sleeve sweater. And yeah, the, again, I've knitted it in the round part of the way. So she's quite pleased with that and let's see who's got dressed today. Back in a minute. Okay, so we've got this little Sasha baby who I had, um, she was one of the ones that I was going to, that I tried to get for my um, granddaughter for her first birthday. She's one that didn't make it. I did get her rerouted. To be honest, I'd asked her to leave the hair long because she had re she'd rooted it quite long and I said, oh, please leave the hair long because I want to be able to put it in pigtails. And then the next thing I knew, I had an email through with pictures of her, her hair cut. So, which is a nuisance because it means her hair always goes over her face. So I'm going to have to get her a hair clip to, to clip it back. Um, so, I mean, it's, it's, it's been rooted nicely. It's just I wanted the hair left long so I could put it back in a ponytail or plait it or whatever. Which was partly why uh, she ended up being rejected as suitable for my granddaughter. Anyway, uh, she's got a dress on that I made. I think I made that one last year. She's got little matching panties. And she doesn't have a name, unfortunately. So I don't usually not name my dolls, particularly the Sasha dolls, but because she wasn't originally going to be mine, I didn't name her. And now I don't know what to call her because she's not quite what I wanted. Anyway, she is sweet. And she fits in with the others, all right. Um, so, happy 20th. Tomorrow is the 21st and we'll have to see what tomorrow brings. I hope you have a great day and please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Please do visit the um, links listed in the description box below. There's March Payne who's just full of comedy when he opens up his Barbie colour reveal advent calendar. There's J Dolls UK, Man of Dolls Rescued, Tammy of Peacecraft Dolls and... Beth, Beth Ramsden, they, they did a collaboration, 
Uh, there's tiny doll whispers and there is octopudding and a few more that I haven't named BC dolls so yeah there's quite a few please do visit the links in the description box below because they're all great fun and it's lovely to see what they're doing for this se this this season so we'll catch you tomorrow bye